Good afternoon, Mary. We're just getting new updates from the City of Long Beach Police Department right now. We've learned that Officer David Walpole, who is a 32 year veteran of the force, was the person who was behind the wheel of that Beach Patrol SUV at the time of this accident. They say he did not see the two victims who were lying on a beach blanket. Those victims did not hear him coming. Now, the police commissioner calling this a tragic freak accident. Surrounded by emergency responders, a couple lying in the sand received aid Sunday evening after being struck by a beach patrol vehicle. It was 7.40 in the evening, an hour and a half after lifeguards clocked out for the day, an hour before sunset. In this social media video, two witnesses explain what they saw. Any idea what happened? I guess somebody just got ran over. The beach patrol, long beach patrol ran over to at the time, the beach was still filled with crowds enjoying the dusk light hours on the shore, while beach patrol officers monitored the water for people who were swimming without a lifeguard. Residents say it's common, especially during the busy summer months. They whistle you out. I've seen it. I've seen that. But um, I guess maybe you didn't see them. I don't know. I really feel bad for both of them. I sure hope the people are okay. The officer behind the wheel of a beach patrol vehicle may have been calling out to people on the jetty to come to shore when the vehicle collided with the beachgoers lying down. Witnesses explain the officer didn't seem to realize what happened. The victims, conscious and alert, were placed on gurneys into the back of a pickup truck patrol vehicle, then transferred to waiting ambulances, taken to South Nassau Community's Hospital in stable condition. The victims were a male and a female. The man was struck in the torso. He is still hospitalized. The female had a broken finger and some bruising to her legs, although she was released from the hospital already. As for the officer involved, he was given a breathalyzer right here on scene, and the police department does not believe that that will come back positive. There's still no word yet on if any disciplinary action will be taken by the City of Long Beach Police Department.